Hello everyone, this is Dino Mike for Class the Octopus. Um, I just wanted to tell you uh, a few things that are happening, a few very, very exciting things, and start this new series. Um, so let's get started. Way back in the fall of 2014, I was in a class at Texas Wesleyan University. I was in a class called The Twilight Zone. Um, which was a playwriting class where we analyzed episodes of The Twilight Zone as short message plays. Plays with a message, with a moral, all that type of stuff. Um, so we analyzed them sort of like one-act plays. And it was a very fun class, still one of the best ones I've ever done. Um, tons, tons of fun. And our final project for that class was to write a message play ourselves. And so for the final project in that class, I wrote a play called Fallen Goldfish, a play about a father, his son, some Viking-like warriors, and a funeral for a goldfish. But more on that later. Two years went by, and in the fall of 2016, last year, there was submissions being held for a competition called Play Market. At Wesleyan, there is a playwriting contest called Play Market every year. It's where only Wesleyan students and alumni are able to submit their plays for a reading at Wesleyan and at every other year, so my freshman year and this year, the plays are taken to be read in New York, which is really exciting. So after several revisions, several new drafts of Fallen Goldfish, after several peer readings and critiques, and <laughs> I'm working on the play as much as possible, I submitted Fallen Goldfish in August of 2016. Then came a long period of waiting, and waiting, and waiting. It was, it was fun. <laughs> and two weeks ago, January 11th, it was a Wednesday, about 9 o'clock, 9.30, I get a call from my counselor slash playwriting teacher, Connie Whit Lambert calling me to say that Fallen Goldfish is the play that's going to be read in New York. And of course, I freaked out. Uh, like, honestly and truthfully freaked out. My, and I was, at, I was at a dance class when this happened, and my family was there, my girlfriend was there, and we were all just, we were all freaking out. So today, Monday, the 23rd, we are having our first meeting of the Play Market class. Uh, the play will be read uh, in New York on May 16th at the Rattlestick Off-Broadway Theater, the Rattlestick Playwright uh, Theater in New York City. And in attendance will not only be my family, who are all dead set on going to New York with me, they're going to do their best and I really hope they can make it, um, but also in attendance will be a lot of New York people hearing the play, which is very, very exciting. Very, very exciting. So what happens now? So in the process of four months, I will be revising certain parts of the play, making it stronger, making it flow better, all that type of stuff. Um, the play market class, the students in there will be getting to know the play, all that type of stuff, know what they have to do on the trip, know what they should pack, all that. That's what the class is, really. And I will be doing a video series on my journey to play market um, in New York. And it's gonna be great. This is gonna be a very, very, very exciting um, semester, to say the least. And it all ends in May. Um, a trip to New York where my play is going to be read on an off-Broadway theater. That is, uh, I'm very thankful for this opportunity. It is absolutely unbelievable. It's gonna be a lot of work from here to, to then, from now to then, and I'm ready to do it. And I couldn't be more happy, more thankful for everything that's happening with this. Yeah, I'm ready, let's do this. Yeah, <laughs> 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 <laughs>